abusiafo me mo bibia kwa ba de ba jensi n page so me din e de ajoa sechi ora kwa ku anyi do former deputy general secretary di ma ndc amayoku no ona so e na oye ceo and founder of atamels memorial institute na o de ensemble atuja ne sem a okin na ne say he has really suffered in the ndc party he has really suffered o wa bre papa e wo party ni mu na oni de o kan story because on person ni man so e be bre te say de ono wa bre no o che say di mbo ni o mu di abo no e ne nda wa ye say o che na wa ye say no e ye too much e wo party ni mu enti no de o kan story papa papa na ni mba so amba me bre enti ni santi no o di book e ba out na book na o tro de aba no e no be bodi oba to ni bo abu bodi papa 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 wo ndc party ni mu amanfo bia na o mo pena sem na o mo pese o mo bre na se o mo pese o mo gu na ni ma se o didi ni na beba na ndc fo mo akasa mo beti mo kaka enka e di e be pie pie book ni mu no enye di nketo akra na asem no emu enche mu ni ora kwa ku anyi dogu e chere se onya ko e fi kuma se na ko ni na ensem o mo kan na ni se ndc fo mpenfo ni bia tena se abo ne ho pose o mo pese o mo bre na se na eye Former president, I want you to be able to call Atamels. Oh, you need to. Just the back here, I will rock with you. I know our former president Atamels. No more. And you're very close to him. Tonight, your man will be here. And tonight, we'll be up. So we'll be here now. And your former president, I want you to be able to call Asakeno. And tonight, we'll be a friend of you. Come and say, I can't do it. I can't. I pour more water. I find you now. I did a train. Now, no. And I will rock with you. I do. I call interview. I will meet FM. So I will make my make my interview me day. So. And I watch and say, and this party the wabre omo, wabre papa, no no what can them? Say ne be ya ne man so em be bre. Na in some what can yes what can kwa. But the book ever out. Na book you know they ever out you know. E di e be be me no. E e professor e i a wo any book no try no. E no cram pen fan no. E di a kesi a kesi no be try try. Na gana fu de be who send this fu e bi mo e ni papa 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 e bi mo e ni suba ni enti en some wura kwa ko ani do e de exuja. Di ano wo. Kumasi, just to embarrass the government. So I wasn't working alone. We had picked up some intelligence, said this will happen. Now, a see here no. It was on Joy FM. They interviewed me. That was the only station interviewed me, Joy FM. Nathaniel Ato. He granted the interview. Go and check. In fact, they have never played my voice again, no. We've just heard stories. Mommy, what I said was that this thing, it looks like a sabotage. So we will investigate. If we investigate and people are found culpable, mm -hmm. na won't touch ma, then heads will roll. Simple. Within five minutes, the lights came on. And they are born marching away here. A man for bomb basso, a man for bomb basso. After the next day, no, na story na sisa. Hmm. Meanwhile, that night, you see, I don't want to say so many things because mm -hmm. I've moved on. Eight years down the line, last year. On a Sempire FM, because he's saying, okay. when the same issue came up, Samson Ladi Ayenini sent a text message into the program, Obi, hosted by Obi. And Samson confessed that he was the one who produced the, the program that interviewed me. And that he can attest to the fact that Okoa Nyudoho never sacked anybody on the airwaves. But I've suffered. Eight solid years. To nine years. Mm. I'm telling you. So if I don't start telling my story, if you're not careful, my children will come and suffer the same indignation. Mm. So I'm beginning to tell my story. And when I tell it, I don't care whose ox is God. Because that night, when this, the lights came on in Kumasi, mm -hmm. I got a call from Kumasi. A senior government official at the time, Dakopu, watch out. By tomorrow, the story will change because certain people here at the stadium with us say you are becoming too powerful. So they will turn the story against you and make sure President Moon sacks you. I don't want to mention their names. Mm. Not now. I'm writing books. And at the right time, their names will be mentioned. I have suffered. Mm. Just to the point where even, you know, you, you don't know what to do. I see if you there, you are some idiot. Mm. Who did I sack? Why was, am I the appointing authority? Mm. That's why fast forward, people got into my position or almost near my position. And they did all kinds of things. Created disaffection for their, their, their own system. Mm. Then they want to blame me. Come on, come on. I didn't sack anybody. So I said, well, this is the story. I didn't sack anybody. He needed, I said, he needed clarification. That's why I'm happy that he put the question. I didn't sack anybody. I don't have any authority. Because of what I'm director of communications, no. 
Tell me, he be a smartphone. Authority Ben Amiwo. I wasn't in any ministry. I didn't appoint anybody. To the extent that somewhere along the line, somebody very close to me, that he was supposed to have been appointed to some state institution. Now I mean, it's so ridiculous. I mean, it's so ridiculous. No, you see, mommy, I was the head of communications. I was a speechwriter. I became the spokesperson. And then up to a point, I knew the, the vulnerability of my president in terms health-wise. It was a sacrificial job. I had to protect him. So my policy, I had a double P policy to protect and to project. That was all. Protect the, so you ask your media men who were with me all those days, mm -hmm. the Dominic, uh, I uh, Dominic. Dominic. I'm telling you, mm, they I will tell Dominic. you. I will remember Pada. Say, could you be a term? And I said, could say, you Maybe I didn't say presidency. You know? mm -hmm. Don't go into propaganda for the president to mm -hmm. just do the right thing. And I'm happy that I trained them. And, 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 and I'm happy to see a lot of them blossom and progress. Oh, <laughs> they think that, oh, oh, they have to pop up and change. And some of them can sit on radio. Oh, I'm telling you. No, I don't know. Don't mind them. Don't mind them. You see, it's like that. Even Judas betrayed Christ. So those ones, I've seen too much betrayal in my life. To be bothered about betrayal. People who came from nowhere. Mm. They, they mentor us, help us. Today, because they think that you are nobody, they can sit on radio and insult me, think that I'll mind them. But you see, people call me and say, are you listening to this social and so and so? I say, Master, even on the cross, Christ said, forgive them, for they don't know what they are doing. Till you, till you do, Ma, I say, Koku, don't, don't worry, tell your story, and we are also here. We love it. Assume you're assume you're there. Assume you're there. Now, come on, me. I I send back to be here. Pa na enchi ya di yangu mo no beba ewe. Yansha yeny parliament. Yes. Yeny development agenda as a country. They say ubi kope parliamentarian have ya. He says a lot of things. I'll do this. I'll do that. O unya tapos na afe na ohu se development na kasan eni ohu send back beba. How do, how do mommy, we handle that? Mommy, first of all, mm -hmm. let me be let me be honest. Mm. The work of the parliamentarians is not an easy job. Uh -huh. Oh, Masa. Mm. Look, the kind of pressure they are under mm. in their constituencies, mm. you have no idea. Mm -hmm. And I I I respect those who want to go to parliament. Mm. It's not it's not in in my DNA though. But I respect those who want to go. Obiane, or see, man, know yourself. Man, know thyself. And it's not in my DNA. This is somebody else's DNA. I respect them for that. But all I know is that, just like the presidency, is not easy. Mm -hmm. So, in parliament, it's not easy. Mm -hmm. The kind of parliament we have now, I mean, and I, 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 at the point in time, I said, I mean, at that time, I didn't even know the NDC was going to present the Honorable Bagwe. So, I said something in one of my tweets, okay, yes, that if the MPP was proposing Michael Quay, I can understand the reason why they are proposing him again. Because for governance purposes, he, after four years, he has built some rapport on both sides of the divide. So with such a tight parliament, I can understand why the NDC, MPP will want to bring him back and not bring in a rookie. And I'm saying it, and I've, I've mentioned his name on air, so I'll mention it again. Okay, who? John Sinasie Dunkitia. Your party general secretary. Good. Whom I contested. Mm -hmm. For which reason he became bitter. Well, hold, on, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. When Ufusuan Pofu, our party chairman, mm. was invited to the BNI, me, Kokwanyido, because of what happened to me, the solidarity, I also went. I was not in the headquarters, but I went. Mm -hmm. I went, and one of your colleague journalists, not necessarily. Uh, Despite, Despite group, but a journalist. He was giving some report to his media room. Mm. Then I accosted him. Because I'll be doing 24 hours. Mm. Because that's what God has given me. So I accosted him. In the process, attention came to two of us. A mm. 
ask any whole action, okay, okay, honorable, why don't you speak and tell us? Because the report he was giving it was a CPA in the group, BNI Ho, and we're misbehaving. Okay. I'm people who are so calm. Hey, Masa, I mean, I'm going to hope you. I'm saying, Masa, you're who you. When he gave, when he wanted to interview me, mm. I said, "Okay, sir, in the crowd, Mister People, wow, who is that who wants to interview Kokwa Nidoho? Don't you know he just went for an election and party lost? I'm telling you, he has no locals in the party. Yeah. I am the general secretary. Come and interview me, Yama. Ah, they decide they are Make a save you. No, he says he's the general secretary, and it's true. In fact, in all essence, in all in, in all fairness to him, he wasn't lying." But when it's done in a manner seeking to embarrass me, I won't give myself to you a second time. Because even this whole arrest, the BNI arrest, send me granting interview. Say, look, something happened in 72. History has an interesting way of repeating itself. So let's be careful it doesn't repeat itself. The next morning, the same machine was on OKFM. So if yeah. there's a history of you distancing yourself from me, even as your deputy, and then you've done, not done it to me when I'm no longer in office, I'll be the biggest fool on earth to attempt to go and speak of, on behalf of the party again because you, all, all you want to do is to embarrass me. I'll not give myself to you as you yeah, to embarrass me. It's only an attempt to do. Oh, Master, oh, if we see if I see him. Interestingly enough, mm -hmm. it, after the Congress, mm -hmm. whatever happened at the Congress, the same as you can offer me. You know, that time near Koye presidential primaries. Okay. Hey, the obedi him. Mm. And when he called me, he called me personally. When he called me, his statement was that Koku, this primaries that we are going, the other contestants almost say, if they don't get somebody of integrity and neutrality on the committee. They will not accept the committee. And that it looks like all of them who are new national executives have compromised themselves because they have openly campaigned in favor of one person. And that when I was executive, and that was one of part of my crime of money, that when I was an executive, I kept saying that colleagues.